Oh, I'm doing my oil change today, y'all. You know, I'll put it back in this one. I'm good. What's good? What's good? All right, we're telling me, recommending me to do mechanic jobs on a block and shit, but I mean, they got some issues over there, but whatever. I got to handle mine first. So again, doing oil change is pretty simple, y'all. The hardest thing is getting the car on these um these little lifts. You can buy them at AutoZone for probably $50. Um, I use Max Life, all right, Valvoline. Get your, you get your oil filter. I got all this on eBay. That's how you got this all the time. Oil catcher. And then, obviously, uh, a ratchet with a 13 millimeter or 14 millimeter, depending on uh, um, which boat is on your car. All right? So, see you soon. So, yeah, so I got my grandfather over there getting cardboard. I don't really need it. Like I said, it's going to be real quick. Literally, get under the car. All right. Where's it at? There's a boat, a boat right here. It's leaking. It's cool. And um, take it out. It's gonna leak all the rest of the oil. And then um, again, put the pan underneath. I'm gonna loosen. That's why it's tight. Let's loosen this shit. As you loosen. It might get a little dirty. Oh, I missed it. Oh, I missed it. It's cool. I'm gonna do it back. It's open? Yeah, it's good. It's good. It's good. Because you don't open it, you throw yeah. it away outside. It's good. It's good. It's good. Yeah, so I need to get a new drain plug also. I'll do it next time. Drain plug. Right. Is it that wet or plug? Electronillo? No, nah, it's not good. No good? No. Put it glue? I am, I am. Can you get it? Yeah, that's it. Yeah, that's it. It looks good. No, it looks good, but it's still leaking a little bit. See? See the, see the one inside? Yeah, but you don't make it good in your tight. Maybe. <laughs> the way it's supposed to go. But I just can't put it glue. Right? Yeah, I got it. So, this drain. Let me get the let me get the gasket um ceiling again. Let me see you see drop man, what are you doing? Check it out, don't build. Alright. Alright. I mean now that part is pretty much over with, right? So Again, I'm on the floor. It's a little bit uncomfortable sometimes, but everything I um, put into the drain catcher, right? Most of it. Besides the stuff that I missed, I move it over. Right. Put it tight enough, but you don't want to strip it. So, that's that right there. Take a rag, clean it. Yeah, so, I kind of already knew that I had a slight oil leak. <clears throat> the last time I changed my oil, and then I had the from the drain plug, so now I'm gonna touch this sealant. If it don't work, 
change the drain plugs. You know, it's two dollar fixes every three months or so. Simple stuff though, nothing crazy. So now, again, you guys can't see this, right? But move the drain pan. Actually, you could, boom, right here. Let's see, right here. There's a little blue cap, right? AutoZone, oh, oil filter. You drop that one also, that's the, that's the last, last step. Now, depending on, depending on if it's tight or not, let me see. You don't need a, good see so mines I could do it with my hands sometimes you got to use a, use a, a oil filter take the screw and you're gonna get dirty it's gonna get dirty it's gonna drop get it ready let's turn it you drop it ah. who's calling me now it's gonna drop boom and then that's the end of the oil change, actually. That's the hardest part. After that, we're just putting in the other oil filter and filling it up. Oh, I'll have my other glove open. Good. But whatever. Mm. So that was the hardest part of the job. Now it's pretty much uh, filling in from the top, right? And then, uh, out of the new oil filter into the same spot. Okay, so now that uh, this is all done, all we gotta do is pretty much clean up. You know the mess, you know the mess. All right. And then, gonna fill up. So, at this point, it's probably been 15 and 20 minutes, you know. Funnel, right? Just place it on the top. Pretty simple, man. Now, my car is about 4.5 quarts, 4.7, let's say. I'm not sure exactly, maybe something like that. Um, I always throw a five because I had that little leak issue, anyways. I never really felt to not put the whole five quarts. I never had an issue. I've been doing this for two years or so. Never had an issue. So, being said, pull the whole bottle. Nothing to worry about. Pretty simple. time also that you check your fluids make sure your car has everything it needs since you're doing the oil change already throwing the oil in fluids in cooling power steering Yeah, I mean, it's not, it's five quarts, whatever. Every, every time you think it's going to take us, two minutes, five minutes, let's say total. And again, it takes a little, a little more time. We're trying to be, trying to be as clean as possible. You know, you gotta re recycle this oil. This oil is bad for, obviously, it's bad for the earth. So AutoZone takes free recycling. So what I'm gonna do is after I'm gonna fill up this jug with the old oil, and I'm, I'm gonna throw it in my trunk. And whenever I go back to AutoZone, I'm just give them the old bottle. Like, yeah, it's recycled. You know, one good deed. You, know, you can try to do it, at least. 
This doesn't cost a lot. This is like 25 bucks total. You buy it online, it's probably like $20, let's say. 20, 20, yeah, 25. 25 total. Done. All done. Off. Yeah. Cover it now. I mean, I could double check and make sure the level is right. I know it's above, so I'm good. Double check on the bottom, and make sure nothing's leaking, and then you start it up. Instantly, it sounds smoother, so I'm really happy with the results. All right, instantly it sounds smoother, um, less noise, you know, and obviously the longer it runs, the cleaner it will sound. Um, pretty much now, I would just drop it, because I already, I should have did it when I was on, but drop it. Right. It says change oil soon, I got to... Go to the, so you drop it, boom. Fall the back, boom, drop it. All right, so then. I know, change oil soon. Information, which one is it? See, oil, like if you hold the, there you go, 99%, boom. So now I'm gonna go from, it'll go three months from, from today more than likely and then it'll, it'll come up with that that signal again so um, <clears throat> and again like I said off the, the ramp pick up the ramps you pick up all this mess like I said this is what I dropped in the beginning but pick up all this mess and uh, oil change is done $25 so guys like I said do your own work and do your own work A little bit over half. Old cat back. All right, a little bit over half. Um, and that's actually after what three or four months. I remember I dropped some of the um, the oil on the floor, so it probably would have been um I probably lost a a whole quart. In three months, I lost the whole court, which is not that good as far as, uh, you know, doing oil changes or whatever. But I knew it was because of that leak. So that's why I was losing the oil. But for the most part, that is, um, those are things to watch out for. Like I said, um, I'll just take the, the old one and I'm going to throw it in the trunk. I get to AutoZone, 
later on I'll buy something else, one of these pieces or whatever, I'll just toss it back. Other than that, everything else is garbage and, and just cleanup time. So, you know, thanks for watching, thanks for tuning in. Appreciate y'all.